Good morning, brothers and sisters. You know, the rapture. This is for the rapture folks. The pre-trib rapture folks. They always claim the Lord's going to take the church out because that's what Paul preaches. Well, why would God pour his wrath out on people that believe and obey him? That would make him an unfaithful God, make him untruthful. He was pouring his wrath out on the unbelievers, the false prophet, and the beast. The ones that worshipped him and believed him and obeyed him was alive during this time, but they wasn't re receiving the wrath of God. That was just for the unbelievers. And Peter was killed. All the apostles were chased down. All but a few of them died. They went through tribulation. Apostle John, Revelation 1, 9. He's in tribulation. But he ain't recurring, recurring the wrath of God. The wrath of man is upon him. The wrath of the devil. But not the wrath of God. The church has just let man lie to them about everything. And they're not even trying to seek the truth. The church go, went through the tribulation. The church does not get out of it, did not get out of it. But yet, people claim Jesus is true and say opposite because Paul taught the church don't go through it. Well, God said that you, you, you will not go through, you will be in the tribulation. You will receive tribulation, but endure to the end. So how can Paul get the rapture wrong and you people still believe him? That's for the one that believe Paul and the rapture's coming. And for the one that know the rapture's history and still defend Paul, how? He got the rapture wrong. Well, it came. He said the church wasn't supposed to go through tribulation. Explain Apostle John. Oh, he wasn't true. Apparently, that's what you say. Only Paul was true, right? Well, Paul got it wrong. Paul got the rapture wrong. But yet, you people still believe Paul. They call him the Christ. You people still believe the rapture's coming because you don't read God's word. You let a preacher man tell you what Apostle Paul said, and that's what you believe. And that's a fact. Dispute me on it. Somebody grow the set and defend the man they follow, the doctrine. The doctrine you push, why can't you come up and defend it without being a butt? You know? How come I'm condemned for following Jesus' words, but you're not for following a man's words? Why does Jesus not matter to the church? They claim him by mouth, but listen to Apostle Paul. Why? Jesus Christ, folks. Jesus Christ. But y'all want Paul. I, I, I just don't get it. I just don't get it. But Paul got the rapture wrong, but you people still worship him. Y'all worshiping the false apostle. I mean, it's right there in, in front of your face, and you're not even paying attention. Why? Because you've offered a free chocolate chip cookie. Well, once you get there, it's going to be a raisin oatmeal. Y'all might want to figure out who you trust. Don't say Jesus and condemn people for saying don't listen to Paul. Listen to Jesus. My goodness, is it so hard to listen to God? I'm praying for you folks.